The Australian Disability Parking Scheme will help to ensure that there are clear, fair, consistent and robust policies to make it easier to identify whether you are eligible for a disability parking permit. A key feature of the scheme is the Australian Disability Parking Permit, which will initially replace over 100 different permit types across Australia and make it easier for permit holders when travelling interstate. The common design for the new national permit will ensure easy recognition by all enforcement officers across Australia. The Australian Disability Parking Permit also includes enhanced security features to help reduce the misuse of parking permits. Permit Formats There are three formats for the Australian Disability Parking Permit design. The first is a hook format and the second is a shorter format without a hook. The third format will be what is used by residents in New South Wales and the Australian Capital Territory. This permit has a plastic pocket into which the existing New South Wales Mobility Parking Scheme photo permit or the existing ACT Mobility Parking Scheme permit must be inserted. If a valid New South Wales or ACT permit is not inserted in the plastic pocket, the words void if no New South Wales or ACT permit inserted here will be visible. In some states, territories and local government areas, separate parking permits may continue to be provided for specific purposes. These permits are not part of the Australian Disability Parking Scheme. Some organisations that transport eligible people with disability may receive an Australian Disability Parking Permit. Otherwise, the usual permits for these vehicles will still apply. Permit Use Existing permit holders will get the new permit in one of two ways. 1. Through the normal permit renewal process when their old permit expires. Or 2. They will be mailed the new permit if their current permit is not due to expire for some time. Existing permit holders, except New South Wales and ACT existing permit holders who receive a new Australian Disability Parking Permit, will be asked to destroy their old permit immediately. Australian Disability Parking Permit holders can park, as usual, in reserve parking spaces displaying the International Symbol of Access and receive concessions in most public parking spaces where the sign or meter shows specific time limits. Permits must only be used when the vehicle is being used to transport the permit holder. Permits must be clearly displayed so the permit number and expiry date are visible from the exterior of the vehicle. Hook permits must be removed from display before the vehicle is driven. This is to ensure the permit does not obscure the vision of the driver. Remember that all Australian Disability Parking Permit holders should check the local rules for parking and obey all other road and parking conditions. Information about these rules and where to apply for an Australian Disability Parking Permit can be obtained through existing state, territory and local government agencies. Permit holders should contact the agency responsible for issuing disability parking permits in their area to check the arrangements for transitioning to the new permit.